So today, I'm gonna close the store real quick. We are doing hairstyles for short hair. And I'm gonna show you guys, so my hair is pretty short. And all you really need is a comb. This is a sexy comb so I'm gonna use this for this kind of part. But take the sectioning and you're gonna make a part. And then flip and then wet my hair. But I need my hair up like this because yeah, I just can you can part it however you want. My hair does not have any product or anything. Okay, this is the first style. Part it. Part it like now, this is really good, though, and you can actually put some products like this gel you use when you get braids and stuff, and I want to style to stay, but that's not today, so. Okay, so we're actually going to do it. Just kind of, I'm going to kind of brush it all back. Don't worry about my face, guys. It broke out a little funny because I'm sitting on my hand. Like that's how it opens. In here, we're going to add like this. Gel it while it's wet. Don't try gel it while it's dry. Little bitch. Like that. And now another little easy thing. All you do is grab a ring. I'm going to take this. And just do a little point of gash. But for people that are like, you look like an idiot. Turn it out. I'm going to take another little thing. And I got these other dollars away. So you guys can make sure you get the ones for it. Don't get those cheap ones. I'm gonna take the back side, and then put it on so I make this one. Rolling my hair thick. So, okay. So now, you want a mohawk after. That's cute too. Another thing you can do is take the bow bands off and rolling my hair. Okay. This is the deal. Shake it off. Shake it out. And we're gonna do a part in the middle. Okay. So, what you do is you follow your nose. And this can be super tight. This is part of your hair. You can even put it if you don't have a section comb like I do. But if you can get these, I got this off the other one. A middle part. I'll use these up. Okay, boom. I already have one. But what you can do, which has to do with the middle part, is taking two sections and I can just take a little part. Make sure you little here you don't need because you'll get it mixed up. I'll get it like this. And then it'll be a lot better. Also, my my. Ow. Boom. There's a little pigtail you can use your hair kind of messy. Use this. And it's like a cute little side, you know. And yeah, if you want it more clean, just come over here and then we're going to get you a little bit. And you might get a little more advanced. You can just put butt action. But you can do this and you can just bump it short. And just like this. And just like this. And just like this. Now I'm gonna do it on this side. And you can do this actually if you section your hair. You can do this exact style on your whole head. You, and um, you can actually wrap hair. So this is what the fun's look like. Okay, so so now that we're done with that hairstyle, I took out the rubber bands and I'll tell you how it looks just without any products or anything in it because I'm gonna brush it back. You can either put all of your hair to one side, and I'll show you that Then you can put the product on it as well. Or you can do this with this little bit of a 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 little I'm not like, I'm not 100% in love with this color anymore, I just think it's really good, but I don't think it's not a good one. And you can like stop and have the hair sit back. So I'm going to do that on this side. Okay, because I'm going to draw on this, I'm going to see where it's a little hard to do, honestly. You're going to take a little section like this. And it's like, ow, I'm conscious of it. And the problem with people when they come to braiding is when the hair gets in the section, it's not supposed to. And the curse wants to be right. So I'm going to take two sections and put some clothes in front of the lid, but I always hold them in the section. And you're going to have a little bit of this.
If you're wanting to do the whole side, just make smaller sections and go up. Um, I'm very sweaty, so I'm going to take a break. But if you guys like this video, like, comment, subscribe. Maybe I'll do some more videos for hair, little, little short videos, and I'll edit this all together. Um, and I love you guys. Bye. Good morning guys, it's the next day now, um, I'm actually very, I just woke up, yuck. Um, I used a face vacuum on my face, uh, cause it broke out a little bit, so my face looks very clean, like look at it, it's a little sore. And I, um, used my face razor and shaped up my face a little, so it looks pretty good guys, um, maybe I'll do a video on that in the future, but, um, I wanted to come on here and just say that yesterday in my video well technically i'm gonna to try to post it today but yesterday when i recorded my uh clips of my short hairstyle video i was kind of um personally going through some uh some personal stuff it's like little little stuff that kind of bothered me and um i was kind of in a mood yesterday not like bitchy mood but i was just a little down so if i seem a little like you know, I did want to record and I did want to get back at it, but I also wanted to um, come on here and talk to you guys about something else. I washed my hair and this is only with shampoo and stuff in it and I don't use shampoo all the time and you know, when you dye your hair, color your hair and bleach your hair, you should um, not wash your hair every day because <laughs> it's not good for your hair. But I wanted to share um, this because other people might be suffering with this too. So everybody has dry skin regardless of what you say, whatever. Um, but some people have it worse than others, and also some people, like, for me, when I start sweating and stuff, like, my scalp will get irritated, or walking and sweating, and, like, uh, you know, cause, like, when you're walking, there's so much, there's so much shit in the air, honestly, so, like, it all is on your scalp, so, like, my scalp gets very irritated, so then, sometimes I'll just be sleeping, and I'm just, like, itching my head. And no, not like lice or anything guys, just like, just literally your scalp can get so fucking irritated and you could feel like your head is on fire because like your scalp just, you just want to itch, <laughs> you just want to itch your head, you know, but it's because of um, the dirt in the air and also because of oils and products, which is why I try to, um, I, um, I want to bleach my hair soon, like my roots and stuff. I'm not exactly sure what color I'm going to do, but I just wanted to, uh, come on here and share that because you know obviously it's a hair video so if you're experiencing any like itchy scalp dry scalp um make sure you're using uh shampoo and, and uh scrub your scalp not hard but make sure you're also not scratching your head because that's how you get cuts and scabs and it hurts so i just want to come on here and say that and i hope you guys enjoy the video and if you like the video um just hit that like button comment subscribe uh and that's all i can really say uh thank you guys for supporting me and it means a lot so have a great day